Well, hi everybody and welcome to Crossroads One. My name is Kevin, I'm the author of the Crossroads program and it's a great joy to, to welcome you to the online version of Crossroads. In addition to a welcome, let me give you some guidelines for what to do in Term 1 of Crossroads Online. You are registered for three courses, three courses that make up Crossroads 1 Term 1 Online. Those three are Growing in God, Your Role in God's Plan, and Reflecting Jesus. At some level, it doesn't really matter what order you do these. You can do them in whichever order you wish. The order in which they are intended to be done would put growing in God first. And the other two, really, you can do them in whichever order you wish. In terms of timelines, you've got three months, provided you started on the 1st of February, you've got three months to finish all three courses. So you need to be completing approximately one course per month. So ideally, by the end of February, you should be finished with growing in God. By the end of March, you should be finished with your role in God's plan, and by the end of April with Reflecting Jesus as well. You need to complete approximately one lesson per week in order to maintain the schedule that we've set, and we think that's going to take you about two to four hours, depending on how much you put into it. When you go into any of the Crossroads courses, you'll find some materials to download. So begin by downloading the study notes. You're going to find a PowerPoint presentation at the start of each lesson and usually two activities that you need to complete in each lesson. One will be uh, a forum post where you need to share something. Usually you need to share something that's of interest to you, something that challenged you. And then there will be a practical assignment. It'll be something that you have to go and do in response to what you've learned. I trust the interface is fairly easy to master, but if you have any trouble with it, please drop me a line. I'll post my contact information on the Crossroads courses. Hopefully we'll get to know each other a little bit as you take this journey, which I pray is going to be a source of inspiration and encouragement in your walk with the Lord. God bless you and may grace be with you.